Hello guys, welcome back to my channel. This is your girl Susie. I'm here for you guys with another video. I'm gonna do a wash and go on my hair. So, how you guys been? Hope you all been doing good, all been safe and uh, taking care of yourself. For today's video, I'm gonna use the Camille Rose Curl Maker. I did use it in my last video um, with my perm rod set and that's where I got the inspiration to use it again. Um, and I'm gonna combine it with uh, another gel. Yeah, they're both jelly. But I'm gonna combine it with this gel, the Extreme Wet Line. I haven't yet got my hand on the new one in Europe. Uh, hair products come slow, slowly. Like, they don't arrive at the same time, so I'm gonna have to buy it online. I'm definitely gonna do it to test the new um, Extreme Gel, because I love their, their gels. So, guys, I'm gonna start off with this section back here. I have, I have already washed my hair, and I've put a little bit of leave-in conditioner inside of it. Not too much because my hair just loves to act up um, with residues. So I'm just going to start off by parting this here into two pieces. And then detangling it. And then I'm gonna part this one. I'm gonna first add my curl maker. I'm not gonna put too much because as I already said, my hair loves to act up. So I'm just gonna put a little bit of it. I'm just gonna put a tiny little bit, just like this. I didn't do that much with my hair. Maybe if maybe I'm using too little. I don't know, I'm not sure. I'm gonna add a, a little bit more. Okay, I feel like this quantity is more than enough. So I'm gonna add some gel on top of it. Maybe that was a little bit too much. And now I'm gonna add the shingling method. I think my hair needs the shingling method. I almost, or I, I can safely say I've never achieved a successful wash and go. Because when I do it, there's, there's always a lot of residue or whatever. So I just throw it at a, um, on a bun or something. But finger crossed, I'm gonna work in small sections because I don't have a whole lot of hair but I want it to look big, so. I'm gonna go with the same method of the curl maker, not putting too much, because I'm afraid of residue. Yes, I am. My hair loves them, so. A little bit. And then on top of it, I'm gonna add a tiny little bit of gel. Oops. Mm 
go ahead and do the shingling method. I'm gonna show you again what I'm doing. This is gonna be the last one and then I'm just gonna first forward it um, and put on some music for you guys. So I have my last piece here. It's already detangled. I'm gonna go in with my Camille Rose Curl Maker. I'm not adding too much because as I said, me, residue, hair, not a good combo. I mean, who likes residue, right? Then I'm gonna add a bit of gel, the wet line, and trim, chill. Plumb them a little bit together. Not leaving it like that though, because I want a lot of definition so so i'm using the shingling method to try and get that definition yep I'm gonna go with a side parting. I always do my parting at this side, but I've seen like a kind of bald spot. No, 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 not what I want. So we're almost there and we're almost out. So They ask you how you are, you just have to say that you're fine when you're not really fine, but you just can't get into it because they would never understand. Student life. So I'm someone who loves to buy makeup. Yes, I buy a lot of makeups which I barely use. I have a lot of eyeshadows and stuff like that, which I, again, barely use. But I've done some work on myself and, and I like the work that I have done on myself. Maybe I'll, I'll Put some so you guys can see um i don't remember doing anything like wow in the past two years and i really want to start practicing makeup again so uh leave a comment down below if you think i should start practicing again and maybe you're in that same situation so maybe we can practice together and I'll just film day by day. Um, I don't know. Um, like one on ones. So guys, I'm done. I'm gonna sit underneath my dryer for a while. And this is the result. Um, I like it. I love it actually. Because um, I see no residue. And and as I told you guys, that's something I've been struggling with.
Um, I wanted the hair to be bigger, but I'm afraid to puff it out too much and then um, I'll ruin the definition. So I'll just let it um, get bigger on its own. Uh, so maybe I'll put a video of tomorrow and um, how it is. Okay guys, I hope you guys liked it. If you did, please go ahead and comment down. Thank you. Let me know if you liked it. Um, let me know if you have any advice for me. Let me know whatever you want. What's going on? What's up? So, I uh, think this is it guys. I'll see you in my next video. And uh, take care. Be good. Bye-bye.